Functions Introduction Find the domain and range, then tell if the relation is a function. And you're given 2, 1, negative 1, 4, 3, 6, and 2, 5. Now, here are some side notes. Functions have only one output for each input. The domain is the set of inputs known as the X values. The range is the set of outputs that is the Y values. So what you want to do here first is identify the X and Ys. So let's take a look at the first one. 2 is going to be an X. Negative 1 is also going to be an X. 3 is going to be an X. And 2 again will be an X. And a good way to remember is that X comes first and X comes before Y in the alphabet. So now we know that our function domain is negative 1, 2, and 3. Also, it's important to know that 2 was repeated, so it's only written down once. Now let's identify the Y's. 1 is a Y. 4 is a Y. 6 is a Y. And 5 is a Y. So now we have a function range. And the range is going to be 1, 4, 5, and 6. So, is this a function? Let's analyze that. Remember, functions have only one output for each input. However, take a look up here. 2 has an output of 1, and it also has an output of 5. Therefore, 2 is an input with two different outputs. 1 and 5 are, the, are two different outputs for, the, for 2. So, is this a function? The answer is no. That's it for this problem, the introduction. You can mark a check and move on to the next problem.